Remember that conjunctions are words that link other words, phrases, clauses, or sentences together. Have a look at the example below. Susan is an amazing wife and a wonderful mom. Note that the conjunction "and" in the sentence is used to link "amazing wife" and "wonderful woman." Now there are many types of conjunctions, and among them are coordinating conjunctions. Now these conjunctions are used to link words, phrases, and clauses of equal importance in a sentence. Have a look at the example over here. Sam complains about his job, yet he doesn't try to find a new job. Note that these two clauses, Sam complains about his job. And he doesn't try to find a new one, are of equal importance in the sentence, and they are connected with the coordinating conjunction yet. Now remember that there are seven coordinating conjunctions, and they are for, and, nor, but, or, yet, and so. Now you can remember them with the help of the acronym Fanboys. Let's have a look at the use of these coordinating conjunctions in a sentence. They couldn't afford to rent the apartment for it was too expensive. You can't have your cake and eat it. Samantha doesn't want to go out, nor does she invite us to our place. I was quite anxious at the beginning, but eventually I managed to pull myself together. You can call me or send a message when you get off from work. Ben says that he is busy all the time, yet he has time to play online games every day. Bill is allergic to dairy, so he doesn't eat any cheese. Note that in all the sentences that we have seen so far, the coordinating conjunctions are used to link two phrases or clauses of equal importance. Now let's review the use of coordinating conjunctions and practice a bit. Remember, the coordinating conjunctions are used to link words, phrases, and clauses of equal importance in a sentence. Now read the following sentences and underline the coordinating conjunctions. Katie wanted to play with us, yet she was too scared to make a move. Yet, the Johns needed to pay the rent, but they ran out of money. But. They weren't on good terms with each other, nor did they try to change it. Nor. Now rewrite the sentence so that they have the same meaning using the coordinating conjunction. Philip likes hiking. He is fond of camping too. That's why he spends a lot of time traveling. Philip likes hiking and camping, so he spends a lot of time traveling. I didn't want to call you because it was too late, but I sent you a message. I knew that you could read it later. I didn't want to call you for it was too late. Yet I sent you a message so you could read it later. Here is a short story using coordinating conjunctions. Listen as I read so you can see how they are used in real life conversation. After I'm done, make sure you understand all the grammar and read aloud yourself so that you can work on your own fluency and. 
pronunciation. My brother's birthday is coming up, yet I have zero ideas as to what to get him. Well, I doubt that gadgets are on your list, for they're too expensive. Maybe there's something he likes a lot. He definitely loves cinema and everything cinema related, but I'm not sure what I can buy. I heard of this online shop where you can buy actual movie poster. Just find out what movie he likes the most so you can get exactly what he wants. That's an awesome idea. Thanks a lot. And now it's time for you to practice on your own. Read the following sentences and underline the correct conjunction. A. Mike claims to be good at time management. So, yet, he does everything last minute. B. Lily wanted to thank the stranger. For, but, he was nowhere to be seen. C. I wasn't in the mood to cook dinner. But, so we ordered a takeout. D. They didn't like our proposal, and nor did they suggest anything else. E. I wanted to see my friend in Seattle, but so I got sick and couldn't go that weekend. F. There was something charming and nor elegant in the way she spoke. G. He can't call you right now for and there is no cell reception. H. Their family lives in different states, yet so they don't often spend holidays together. My sister always gets up early, for yet she is running late every single day. J. Pete doesn't exercise, nor, but, does he eat healthy. And now, let's check your answers. Mike claims to be good at time management, yet he does everything last minute. Lily wanted to thank the stranger, but he was nowhere to be seen. I wasn't in the mood to cook dinner, so we ordered a takeout. They didn't like our proposal, nor did they suggest anything else. I wanted to see my friend in Seattle, but I got sick and couldn't go that weekend. There was something charming and elegant in the way she spoke. He can't call you right now, for there is no cell reception. Their family lives in different states, so they don't often spend holidays together. My sister always gets up early, and she is running late every single day. Pete doesn't exercise, nor does he eat healthy. Thank you for watching this tutorial.